yes so that i couldn't switch to the camera um little parts like this this is uh like a form for the fab fabricate the welder he uses it for forming like swirls and stuff like that and bending it around it's something that he's made himself so uh we're just going to be powder coating it just to make it a little bit more prettier um going over to the gun I did intend to do a video of me first using it but I wasn't really that organised so we're getting better but the, the gun itself if you're, any, if you're ever thinking of buying one it's so easy to use and the electrostatic magic it really does, uh, the powder does cling onto the, the piece of metal you're working on. I've, I've sprayed it on one side of a piece of metal and it has coated both sides. So you, you basically only have to just lightly dust the other side. Um, if I could set up my tripod, I'll, I'll, I'll show you uh, me using it. So, um, but if you're thinking of buying one, I think it's a handy little thing to have. Um, if you're doing your own bit of powder coating, I think the, the hardest thing for you to set up yourself really is having your own little shot blaster because you need to clean off whatever it is you're going to be powder coating. But apart from that, the powder coating itself is the most simplest thing to do. It's the prep is, is, the, is where the work is at and, and that determines how good your finish is. So I'll keep on doing some small videos, guys, and... Um, Put a, and I'll put them all together and stick it all on YouTube. 